We surpassed ourselves with this one. Um, I've never seen that much filmmakers show up at the event. I'd say we had at least um, 10 to 15 participating films. The filmmakers were present um, out of 49, and that's a big, a big jump. As the director of the Belize International Film Festival explained, this year's festival was a success. The festival opened with the screening of Home Again, a feature film directed by Suds Sutherland that incorporates the story of three main characters that were deported to Jamaica after being raised abroad. I'm only here for a minute. Enjoy your minute. I really need this job. You're a deportee, aren't you? You can't hire a criminal. After that film ended, 48 other films, including music videos, played on the big screen at the Princess Hotel. A panel of four jurors watched and critiqued each screening carefully and chose the winners for each category. Sitting alongside Cuban director Rigoberto Lopez, the vice president of creative and visual contact for Warner Brothers, Denise Williams Watts, and founder and chair of film London, Sandy Lieberson, was American actress Erica Alexander. As a juror, I look at it the same way as I might pick a script when I'm at home. First of all, you're looking at story, 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 story. What is the filmmaker trying to say? Then you're looking at how is he trying to say it? How unique can he say it? You're also looking at quality. Are they using the best of what they have? Are they using maybe even very primitive means? What are they doing it to the best of their ability? Have they found a new way to make that interesting? So it shows that you can do just as much with a very expensive camera or a digital iPhoto camera. It doesn't matter if you have a good story and you have an interesting way in and you've done your homework and you have the good advice or the good teaching of all that's come before you. You can create genius. There were six categories, including that of the most notable Belizean film, which was won by Maroons, Africans on the Move, which was shot in Guatemala, Jamaica, and Belize. Them operate, you know. This is our kind of people and the Maroon people are the same people, a one type of people. These are the Garifunas of Central America. They have come from Belize, they have come from... The film was directed by Michael Flores. It's a short documentary that looked at the cultural similarity and African cultural continuity between the Maroons of Jamaica, the Garifunas of Central America, and other Maroons in the diaspora, for example, Suriname, uh, the Gullah Geechee Islands, and Maroons totally in a whole in, in the world as a evolution of our history as, as, as people in the world. There was also the category for music videos, which was the only tie in the festival. The award for best music video was shared by Melanie Gillett's Come Away, directed by Ben Hudson, and Tanya Carter's ex-boyfriend, directed and produced by Carlos Habet. Um, at the end of the day, we wanted to do something that, you know, brought the song to life and gave people an idea of what it is she was singing about. And apparently, uh, we succeeded. Um, from here on, we have another video to shoot this Thursday, actually, and we're going to be working on that fervently between now and next week as well in post so we have more stuff for you guys Belize and I'm um, very humbled and flattered that we, we, we were picked and we, we tied because kudos as well to Melanie Gillette who is um, another stalwart in the industry with a lot of great work behind her as well so just proud that we got picked and I'm gonna you know raise the bar from here on out. With a record of 49 screening, the film industry in Belize is showing signs of improvement but one of the most difficult hurdles to overcome is financing. The thing of money, you, you have to, to sort of have a passion for what you do so that you save every little penny that you have to invest it in your work. It's a knock and go kind of a thing uh, because here in Belize we don't necessarily have that money but we do have time, we, we're able to sacrifice and we have good people who support us. Grants are out there to be accessed but you can't send in a book. To get a grant, you have to send in a proposal which says, these are my actors. I think people are going to come watch because I have Tom Cruise in it. So I have more chance that I'll recover my money. And, and, yeah, and the different things involved. Now, the, if the government offer incentives, look, we can invest one million, but you'll get back so much money at the end. So there's all kinds of, I mean, that will, that's what's going to encourage more investors. Reporting for Love News, I am Hippolyta Novello.